If you had asked me a year ago, could a synagogue survive having its sanctuary closed for six straight months, I don't know that I could have answered. I think I would have started to cry. In fact, I did cry in March when we made the decision to suspend operations here at BZBI. And yet, here we are, more than surviving. We are thriving as a congregation. We have learned all kinds of new technologies, new ways of being together. We've doubled down on the old ways of calling, of reaching out to lend a hand, to drop off groceries, to help get people to doctor's appointments and everything else that a community does for one another. So I find myself on this most bizarre Yom Kippur full of gratitude for a congregation that is so committed to its sacred mission that we will do what it takes, even under the circumstances that we have found ourselves in this year, we will do anything it takes to stay together as a community. We turn to page 44 for the psalm for the season. <laughs> Turn to page 67, Nishmat Kol Chai, the breath of all life sings praise to you, Adonai. We take a few moments to breathe and arrive to this day of Yom Kippur. Nishmat Kol Chai, Tivarech Shimcha, Adonai Eloheinu. Veruach kol basar, tifa'er utramim zichicham alkeinu, tamid ina olam adolam atayam. V'adonai lo yanum lo yishan hamarishim amitivam. Hey, 
In just a moment, we're going to begin Shacharit and um, was reading on page 68, this beautiful liturgy. So the organs you formed within us, the spirit and soul you breathed into our nostrils, the tongue you placed in our mouths, they will all thank and bless, praise and exalt, sanctify and crown your name, our sovereign. So we're mindful, uh, all of us in this time of the, the vulnerability of our bodies, You'll notice that Rabbi Yosef and I are taking a little bit of an extra precaution. We have many precautions in place in the sanctuary. We are okay. Our child is a little bit under the weather today. Likely nothing but just adding an extra layer of protection. We are wearing masks. This morning I'll be speaking without a mask later on um, from my office um, here in BZBI. So we are together, all of us grateful for this opportunity to join together from home here at BZBI, and we are delighted that Johanna Lebo is going to lead us in Shacharit this morning, which begins on page 69. Ah, 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 ah. Rachod vehodaot meataviad olam baruch ata Adonai el melech gadol batish bachot el ahodaot Adonani flaot abocher b'shirei zimra melech alchei haolamim yit gadol veyit gadash shemei rabah be'almadi vrach kirutei v'yamlich malchute. Bechaye Honu, Yome Honu, Chaye de Hobbit Israel, Bagala, Wisman, Karid, Imeru, Amen. Ye Shmirabam, Evarach, Lelamo, Maya, Eat Barach, Vishabach, Vit Bar, Vitraman, Vina, say, Vita Dar, Vita Levi, Tala, Shmedekudesha, very cool. Leila, Leila, Mikovir Hatavashirata, 
תוש בחרתה בנחמתה, דמירן בעלמא וימרו, אמן. We rise in body and spirit as we turn to page 71. Baruch Adonai HaMevorach Le'olam Va'en Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Avoteach Lanu Shari Rachamim Umeir Einei HaMechakim L'Slichato Yoter Or Uvore Choshech Ose Shalom Uvore Et Akol Or Olam Be'otzar Chaim Orot Me'ofel Amar Va'yehi Feel free to be seated as we continue on page 72. יפרח אדוני אלוהינו על שבח מעשה ידיך ועל מאורי אור שעשית יפרוך הסלע. יפרח צורנו מלכנו וגואלנו. וכולם פותחים את פיהם בקדושה וטהרה, בשירה ובזמרה, מברכים ומשבחים ופרים, ומריצים ומקדישים וממליכים. את שם האל המלך הגדול, הגיבור בנו הקדוש הוא. וכולם מקבלים עליהם המלכות שמיים זה מזה, ודוניים רשות זה לזה, להקדיש ליוצרם בנחת רוח. ושפה ורב נימה קדושה, כולם כאחד עונים ואומרים ביראה. קדוש, 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 אדוני צבאות, מלוך כל הארץ כבודו. אור חדש על ציון תאיר ונזכה כולנו מהרה לאורו ברוך אתה אדוני יוצר המאורות אהבה רבה אהבתנו אדוני וקרבתנו לשמך הגדול סלע באמת, להודות לך ולייחד לך באהבה, ברוך אתה אדוני, הבוחר בעמו ישראל באהבה. שמע ישראל, אדוני אלוהינו, אדוני אחד. ברוך שם כבוד מלכותו לעולם ועד.
We're in the middle of page 78. Adonaim loch leolam ba'en. Sur Yisrael, kuma bezrat Yisrael, uvdechinu mecha yudav Yisrael, go aleinu Adonai tzvot shemo, kedosh Yisrael, baruch at Adonai, gal Yisrael. We rise in personal prayer. You'll find the private Amidah for Yom Kippur morning on pages 213 through 221.
If you're still davening, please continue at your own pace. We turn to page 252 for the repetition of the Shacharit Amidah, and we rise as the ark is opened. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu Elohei avoteinu Elohei Avraham Elohei Yitzchak Elohei Yaakov Elohei Sarah Elohei Rivka Elohei Rachel Elohei Leah Ha'el Hagadol Hagibor Vahanora El Elyon Kom El Chasadim Tovim Vekone Hakol Vezocher Chaste Avot Ume Vigo Eliv Nevenehem Leman Shemo Piahava Nisor Chachamim Urvonim Ume Lem Edad Mevinim Efte Chavi Bitvila Uvatachanonim Lechalot ulechanein p'nei melech Malei rachamim alchalos oleach l'avonim Zochreinu lechaim Melech hafetz b'chaim Vechotveinu b'sefer hachaim Leman cha Elohim chaim Melech ozer ufokedu moshia umagein Baruch at Adonai Magen Avraham ufoked sarah Ata gibor leolam Adonai, mechaim iti matarav lehoshia, mechal kel chaim bechesed, mechaim iti berachamim rabim, somech noflim verofe cholim, umatir asurim. Umekayem emunato Lishene afar Michamochav al gevorot Umidom elach Melech meibitu mechayet Umatmiach yeshu Ve'karazel el te 
Kadosh, 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 Adonai Tevaot, Melochol Haaretz, Kevodo, Kevodo, Male Olam, Mesharta Shoalim, Zelazeh, Aye, Mekom Kevodo, Leumatam Baruch Yom Eru. Baruch kevod Adonai Mim komo Mim komo Hu yithan berachamim Ve'yachon amam yachad im shemo Erev avoke bechol yom tamid Pamayim bi'ava shema omrim Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad Hu Eloheinu Hu Avinu Hu Malkeinu Hu Moshiinu Vehu Yashmiinu Berachem Avshenin Leinei Kochai Liot lachem l'Elohim, ani Adonai Eloheichem. Adir adireinu Adonai Adoneinu, ma'adir shimcha bechol aretz. Vayadonai l'melech hakol haaretz bayom ha'hu. Ie Adonai Echad, U Shemo Echad, Uvdivrei Kodshecha Katuv Lemor. Im lo Adonai Leolam Elohai Echtion, Ledor Vador, Hallelujah. Ledor Vador, Nagid God Lecha, Ulenetzach Netzachim Kedushad Chan Aktish, Veshivcha Cha Eloheinu Mipino Leyamush Leolam Ba'ed. כי המלך גדול וקדוש אתה. Feel free to be seated as we continue on page 259. קדוש אתה ונורא שמך ואין אלוה מבלעדך ככתוב ויגבר עונה אצבעות במשפט והאל הקדוש נקדש בצדקה ברוך אתה אדוני המלך הקדוש. אתה בחרתנו מכל העמים, אהבת אותנו ורצית בנו ורוממתנו מכל הלשונות, וקידשנו ממצוותיך, וקרבתנו מלכנו לעבודתך, ושמך גדול וקדוש עלינו קראת, ותיתן לנו אדוני אלוהינו באהבת יום הכיפורים הזה, למחילה ולסליחה לך פרה. ולמחול בו את כל עוונותינו, מקרא קודש, זכר לציאת מצרים, אלוהינו ולא יבותינו, יעלה ויבוא ויגיע וייראה וירצה וישמע ויפקד, וייזכר זיכרוננו וגדוננו, וזיכרון אבותינו, וזיכרון משיח בן דוד עבדך, וזיכרון ירושלים עיר קודשך, וזיכרון כל עמך בית ישראל לפניך, לפלטה לטובה, לחינו לחסד רחמים וחיים ושלום, ביום הכיפורים הזה. זוכרינו אדוני אלוהינו בואו לטובה ופוקדינו בואו לברכה והושיענו בואו לחיים ובדבר ישוע ברחמים חוס וכוננו ברחם עלינו והושיענו כי אל החיינינו כי המלך הנון ורחום אתה We rise for Slichot, page 261. <laughs> וירד אדוני בענן, ויתייצב עמו שם, ויקרא בשם אדוני, ויעבור אדוני על פניו, ויקרא, 
Adonai, Adonai, El Rachum Bechanun, Erech Hapaim, Berach Chesed Be'emet, Noter Chesed La'alafim, Nose Avon Vapesha Vechata, Venake Vesalachta Labonenu Uchatatenu Unechaltanu Slachlanu Avinu Kichatanu Mechalanu Malkenu Kipashanu Kiata Adonai Tobesalach Verav Chesed The confessional prayers begin on page 264. <laughs> 
जीवाण जाके आया We look to the bottom paragraph on page 264. Umolet leva venu la valira et chemecha, kakatu vetoratecha, umal adonai elohecha, elovavcha, et levav zarecha, leahava et adonai elohecha, becholavavcha, uvachol nachecha leman chayecha. We rise again as we continue with confessional prayers on page 266. Al Khit Shekhatanu Lefanecha Bi'etzer Hara Ve'al Khit Shekhatanu Lefanecha Bi'yodim Uvelo Yodim Ve'al Kulam Eloai Selichon Selach Lanu Mechalanu Al-Khit Shekhatanu Lefanecha Beinayim Ramot Ve'al-Khit Shekhatanu Lefanecha Be'azud Metzach Ve'al Kulam Eloas Elichot Selach Lanu Mechalanu
Kaharet, Mekadesh Israel, Melech Kaharet, Mekadesh Israel, Vayom Hakifurim. Ritze Adonai Loheinu, Bamcha Yisrael, Vitzvilatam, Vashevet Avod Ali, Vir Betacha, Utvilatam, Vatika Belbaraton, Utihil Raton, Tamid Avod Ali Yisrael, Amecha. Vetechazen ha'eninu v'shuvcha l'tziyom b'rachamim Baruch atah Adonai Amachazir shchinato l'tziyom Modim anachnu l'ach Atov kilo chalo rachamecha, v'am rachem kilo tamocha tzadecha, me'olam kivinu lach, v'al kulam itbarach v'itromam shimcha malkeinu tamid le'olam v'ed. Avinu malkeinu zechor rachamecha, u'chavosh chascha v'chale, דבר וחרב ורב ושבי ומשחית בעוון ושמד ומגפה ופגרה וכל מחלה וכל תגלה וכל קצתה וכל מיני פרעניות וכל גזירה רע ושנאת חינם מעלינו ומעל כל בני בריתך וכתוב לחיים לחיים טובים כל בני בריתך, וכל החיים ידעו אותך סלע, ויעלו את שמך באמת, על ישועתנו ועזרתנו סלע. ברוך אתה אדוני, הטוב שמך ולכן אלה הודות. אלוהינו ולאבותינו, ברכנו בברכה המשולשת בתורה, הכתובה הנה משה עבדיך, המורה מפי אהרון ובניו, כהנים עם קדושך, כאמור, יברך לך אדוני וישמרך. Thank you. 
Israel Chaim Tovim Ule Shalom Anachnu Vechol Amcha Beit Israel Chaim Tovim Ule Shalom Baruch Atah Adonai Oseh HaShalom Avinu Malkeinu Chatanu Lefanecha Avinu Malkeinu Avinu Malkeinu Hachazirenu Bichuva Shlema Lefanecha Avinu Malkeinu Shlach Refua Shlema Lecholei Amecha Avinu Malkeinu Zochreinu Bezikaron Tov Lefanecha Avinu Malkeinu, Kotvenu Besefer Chaim Tovim. Avinu Malkeinu, Kotvenu Besefer Gilav Yeshua. Avinu Malkeinu, Kotvenu Besefer Parnasa Bechalkala. Avinu Malkeinu Kotvenu Besefer Zichuyot Avinu Malkeinu Kotvenu Besefer Slicha Umechila Avinu Malkeinu Aseh Leman Ba'ev Ba'esh Uvamayim Al Kiddush Shemecha Avinu Malkeinu Aseh Leman Chaim Lo Leman Einu Avinu Malkeinu Choneinu Aneinu Avinu Yitgadal v'yitgadash emei rabba Ve'amad ibrach kirutei ve'amlich machutei 
We're going to turn now to our Torah service. It begins on page 274. In Kamo Chava Elohim Adonai V'in Kemasecha Malchut Echa Malchut Kol Alamim Umem Shaltecha Bechol Dov Ador Adonai Melech Adonai Malach Adonai Yimlach Leolam Ba'em Adonai Oz Leamu Yitain Adonai Yivarek it's <laughs> Adon Olamim, Adon Olamim. We rise as we're able, as the ark is opened. Vayhi bin Tzoharon, Vayomer Moshe. Kuma Adonai via Futsu Oi Vecha via Nusu Misanecha Mipanecha Ki Mition Kate Tora Ki Mition Kate Tora Udvar Adonai Mirushalayim Baruch Shenatan Torah Torah Baruch Shenatan Torah Torah Le'amo Yisrael Bikidusha Torah Page 275 Adonai, Adonai, El Rachum Vechanun, Erech HaChaim, Virav Chesed Veyemet, Noser Chesed Lalafim, Nose Abon Vapesha, Vichalta Vinachei, Adonai, Adonai, El Rachum Bechanun, Erech Apayim, Rav Chesed Veyemet, Nozer Chesed 
והאלפים נושא עוון בפשע וחטא ונקה אדוני אדוני אל הקום וחנון ערב חיים ורב חסד ויאמץ נוצר חסד לאלפים נושא עוון ופשע וחטא ונקה. ואני תפילתי לך אדוני את רצון אלוהים ברוב חסדך ענני ענני וימת אישך אני תפילתי לך אדוני את רצון אלוהים ברוב חסדך ענני ענני בימי אישך ואני תפילתי לך אדוני את רצון אלוהים ברוב חסדך ענני ענני באמת אישך. שמא ישראל אדוני אלוהינו, אדוני אחד. שמי ישראל, אדוני אלוהינו, אדוני אחד. אחד אלוהינו. גדול אדוננו, קדוש ונורא שמו. אלכוד אלוהינו, גדול אדוננו, קדוש ונורא שמו. קדלו אדוני איתי. ונרוממה שמו Bye-bye. 
Emet man hadar haya kohen gadol. How glorious was the kohen gadol, the tune uh, that Rabbi Annie and Rabbi Yosef just sang, if you didn't recognize it, uh, is a popular setting for a piyut from the Seder Avodah, the section of Musaf that we'll do later that describes the way Yom Kippur was observed during the time of the second Beit HaMikdash, the second temple. And our Torah reading this morning takes us back yet further to the very first Yom Kippur as our ancestors were traveling through the wilderness, having just built the Mishkan, the portable sanctuary that they would take with them from place to place. God teaches Moshe and Aharon how to do the rituals of Yom Kippur, how to celebrate this day in its very first incarnation. And it is so far removed from our Yom Kippur. Uh, but I actually think that we have never been in a better position to open ourselves up to the richness and the power of these rituals, to know what was in another time, because so much has changed for us. Everything that we grew up with, the way that we understood Yom Kippur to be, all of the years, however many years you've been doing Yom Kippur, it's all different now. And so having let go of our assumptions, our expectations of what Yom Kippur should look like, let's travel all the way back in time to experience Yom Kippur as it was all the way at the beginning. I'd like to thank in advance Adam Laver for uh, reading Torah this morning. And I don't have a moxer in front of me, so uh, before she calls the first Oled, Ginny Green will tell us what page to find the Torah reading for Yom Kippur. Amen. Fight up there, Adonai, O Moshe, Acharemot, 
Snee Vide Acharon, the Korba Tamlif Ne Adonai, Vai Amutu, Vai Omer Adonai, Amoshe, Taber El Acharon Achicha, Yal Yavo, Bifol Eit El Hakodesh, Mi Beit Acharon. Avne ha kaporet asher al haron velo yamut ki banan erae al ha kaporet Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam asher natan lanu Torah emet v'chaye olam nota betochenu Baruch atah Adonai nontein haTorah.
hear. Let me see if I can hear on my end. Dr. Goldberg, we're ready for your bracha. Okay. Bracha is Adonai Hamburah. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Asher Bocharbonu Mikol Amim No Sanono Es Toroso Baruch Atah Adonai No Sena Torah Amen Amen Bacach Lohama Ta Kahle Shnea Hamisea Milifnea Adonai um <laughs> Apne ha kapore tedma, lipne ha kapore, yazesh of the pamim, in hazam beto. Shahat, etzir ha tash asher laam, the hebi atamo, el mi be la paroke, yasatamo, asher a saladam ha par, ita oto. Aha kapore to his name, ha kapore. Kitar al hako dash me to moat in Israel. Umi pishay ham with all hato tam. If hain ya sell o kamoe, a shokani tam betok to me. Ah. If all a tam, we hear o kamoe to go. The kapar of a kodesh hateto. The kipar of a do hateto. Amen. <laughs> Amen. 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 Amen.
ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם אשר נתן לנו תורת אמת ובחיי עולם נטע בתוכנו ברוך אתה אדוני נותן התורה.
At the end of last night's Kol Nidre services, Rabbi Yosef uh, remarked to me how strange it was not to go back to the vestibule to shake hands and offer holiday greetings as people left the service. And among the people who were not there to greet the congregation last night was BZBI's new executive director, Dr. Rebecca Slavin Phillips. Rebecca joined the BZBI team shortly after Pesach in the midst of all of the dislocations of COVID-19 and hit the ground running full of enthusiasm, energy, passion for her work, and has been, uh, together with Rabbi Annie and I, an instrumental support for getting these services to happen in the way that we have been enjoying. And so, I am uh, overjoyed that Rebecca is able to join us via Zoom to share her Yom Kippur greetings with the congregation. Hi, everyone. I'm Rebecca Slavin Phillips, your executive director. And thank you to the rabbis, staff, volunteers, and the High Holiday Task Force for making the High Holidays so successful and such a meaningful experience at BZBI. A special thank you also to Dr. Daniel and Beverly Goldberg for the donation of the beautiful new blue carpet in the sanctuary. I also wanna thank the congregation, the board and the staff for being so welcoming over the last months. I have enjoyed getting to know all of you. I'm looking forward to meeting more people in person as conditions improve. Speaking of this, I know this has been a trying time and I appreciate how the congregation has come together and will continue to support each other along with our wonderful staff as we navigate through COVID. We have many plans for the new year as we, such as beginning to renovate our kitchen and installing an all new security system this week from a grant we have procured and continuing to update and take a critical look at our processes, procedures, and programs. I wanna remind everyone that my physical and virtual door is always open. I welcome your thoughts. I also welcome each of you to make this year that you become more involved with the synagogue in some way to find your BZBI connection. Shana Tava, have a happy and healthy 5751 and an easy rest of your fast. Thank you, Rebecca. We'll continue now with the Maftir Aliyah. <laughs> Baruch Hu et Adonai Hamborach. Baruch Adonai Hamborach Leolam Ba'ed. Baruch Adonai Hamborach Leolam Ba'ed. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam. Asher b'chabanu mikol ha'amim v'natan lanu et Torato. Baruch Atah Adonai Noten HaTorah. Amen. Ruga Shalom. Ruga Shalom. Bahodesh 
echad ayel echad. Kibasim b'nei shana shiva timimim yihiyu lachem. Umin hatam solet ulav hasham en shlosha esronim lapar shnei esronim la'ayel ha'echad. Isaron Isaron la keves ha'echad l'shiva ta'kibasim. Sirezim echad ha'atad mi'ovad ha'atad ha'kipurim v'olat ha'tamid u'min ha'atad v'yizkehem. Baruch ha'atad Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam asher natalanu torat emet v'chaye olam nata v'tochenu baruch ha'atad Adonai noten ha'torah Amen. Yesher Koach, to Adam Laver for reading Torah this morning, to Jenny yep. Green for serving as our Gabbai, and to Sandy Moses, who will chant Haftarah for us this morning. So you'll see that I'm standing in the chapel of BZBI. This has been a year of improvisation as we adjust to a whole new reality and thank God everything is okay but we have a child who woke up with some sniffles so out of an abundance of caution I'll be speaking without a mask by myself here in the chapel and when Rabbi Yosef and I are singing in the sanctuary today very distanced from our community we'll be wearing masks I um, just wanted to, to let everyone know what's happening this past week Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg of blessed memory received the great honor of lying in state in the United States Capitol. She was the first Jewish American to receive this honor, the first woman to receive this honor, the first Jewish woman to receive this great honor. Rabbi Lauren Holtzblatt of Congregation Addis Israel in Washington, D.C. eulogized Justice Ginsburg. And she spoke about the piece of art hanging in Justice Ginsburg's chambers, a passage from the book of Deuteronomy reading, Tzedek, Tzedek, Tirdof, justice, justice, you must pursue. Rabbi Holtzblatt shared how many commentators noticed the repetition of the word tzedek, of the word justice in this pasuk, in this verse, and they ask, why is it justice, justice, you must pursue? Why is the word tzedek repeated? According to Rabbi Avraham Ibn Ezra, the repetition of the word tzedek emphasizes that one must pursue justice on all the days of one's life. Each Yom Kippur in our Haftarah, the prophet Isaiah calls out to us to return to our pursuit of justice. He relays the words of God saying, is such the fast I desire? A day for humans to starve their bodies? No, this is the fast I desire, to unlock the fetters of wickedness, to untie the cords of the yoke, to let the oppressed go free, to break off every yoke. It is to share your bread with the hungry and to take the poor into your home. When you see the naked, clothe them and do not ignore your own kin. Isaiah offers a social critique of those who approach ritual with precision but desist from moral responsibility in the world around us. Year after year, generation after generation, the prophet calls out to us that it is not enough to go through the motions of fasting. Rather, the fast is meant to feed our stockpiles of moral courage and to lead us toward acts of justice. May our Yom Kippur observance strengthen our resolve to pursue justice all the days of our lives. Our Haftarah can be found on page 284, and we turn to Sandy Moses. Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Erbachar in Vim Tovim, Verat Shabbat Ibrahim, Hane Marim Bemet, Baruchata Adonai, Aboker Batora, Uba Moshe Abdo, Uba Yisrael Amo, 
וזרח בחושך עולך ואפלתך כצהריים. ונחך אדוני תמיד. והשביע בצחצחות נפשך ועצמותך יחליץ והיית כגן רבה וכמוצא וכמוצא המים אשר לא יחזרו מימיו ובנו ממך חרבות עולם מוסדי דור ודור תקומם וקורא לך גודל פרץ נשבב נתיבות לשבת אם תשיב משבת רגליך עשות חפציך ביום קודשי וקראת לשבת עונג לקדוש אדוני מכובד וכיבדתו מעשור דרכיך למסוך אפסך ודבר דבר אז תתענג על אדוני והרכבתיך על במתם ארץ והאכילתיך נחלת יעקב אביך כי היא אדוני דיבר. ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם. צור כל העולמים צדיק בכל הדורות. האל הנאמן האומר ויוסר המדבר ומקיים שכל דבריו הם מפה צדק. נאמן אתה הוא אדוני אלוהינו ונאמנים דבריך ודבר אחד מדבריך, אחו לא ישוב ריקם, כי על מלך נאמן ורחמן אתה, ברוך אתה אדוני, האל הנאמן בכל דבריו. רחם על ציון כי בית חיינו, ולעלו בת נפש תושיע במהרה בימינו, ברוך אתה אדוני, נשמח ציון בבניה. סמכתנו אדוני אלוהינו ואליהו הנביא עבדך ובמלכות בית דוד משיחך במהרה יבוא ויגל ליבנו על כיסו לא ישב זר ולא יאכלו עוד אחרים את כבודו כי בשם קודשך נשפט לו שלא יכפה נרו לעולם בעת ברוך אתה אדוני מגן דוד על התורה ועל העבודה ועל הנביאים ועל יום הכיפורים הזה שנתת לנו אדוני אלוהינו למחילה ולסליחה לכפרה לכבוד ולתפארת על הכל אדוני אלוהינו אנחנו מודים לך ומברכים אותך יתברך שמך בפי כל חי תמיד לעולם ועד וברך האמת וקיים לעד, ברוך אתה אדוני, מלך מוכר וסולח לעוונותינו ולעוונות עם הבית ישראל ומעביר משמעותינו בכל שנה ושנה, מלך על כל הארץ, מקדש ישראל ויום הכיפורים. אמן. to Sandy. In this time of pandemic, we pour out our hearts in prayers for healing, for refuah shlema, for complete healing of body and spirit, of heart and of mind. We pray for courage, for safety for all who are first responders and medical professionals and essential workers doing all they can to save lives and sustain lives during this time. I'm going to chant the words that Moses sang out when he prayed for healing for his sister Miriam when she had fallen ill. Ana Elna Rifana La. I invite you to join me in chanting these words, and I invite you to speak the names out loud of all of those for whom you are praying for healing today. Speak them out loud. 
in your homes, here in the sanctuary, and we'll lift all our prayers for healing. We turn now to page 288 with a prayer for those who serve the community, which will be led by Carmi Levine. May God who blessed our ancestors, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Sarah, Rebecca, Rachel, and Leah, bless this entire congregation together with all holy congregations, them, their sons and daughters, their families, and all that is theirs, along with those who unite to establish synagogues for prayer and those who enter them to pray, and those who give funds for heat and light, and wine for Kiddush and Havdalah, bread to the wayfarer and charity to the poor, and all who devotedly involve themselves with the needs of this community and the land of Israel. May the Holy One reward them, remove sickness from them, heal them, and forgive their sins. May God bless them by making all their worthy endeavor, endeavors prosper, as well as those of the entire people Israel. And let us say, Amen. Amen. Continue with the prayer for our country at the bottom of page 288, which will be led for us by Woody and Susan Goldberg. Thank you, Rabbi Abe, for this special honor. May each of you be sealed in the book of life, Gamar Tova. Our God and God of our ancestors, with mercy accept our prayer on behalf of our country and its government. Pour out your blessings upon this land on its leaders, its judges, officers, and officials who are devoted in good faith to the needs of the public. Instruct them with the laws of your Torah and help them understand your rules of justice so that peace and security, happiness and freedom will never depart from our land. We pray, Adonai, God whose spirit in all creation Awaken the spirit within all the inhabitants of our land. Uproot from their hearts hatred and malice, jealousy and strife. Plant among those of different nationalities and faiths who dwell in our nation, love and companionship, peace and friendship. May it therefore be your will that our land be a blessing to all who dwell on earth and cause them to dwell in friendship and freedom. Speedily fulfill the vision of your prophets. Nation shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war any more. For, For all, all of them, them from, from the, the least, least of them, them to, to the, the greatest, greatest shall, shall know me. me. And let and us let say, for the Amen. land of the free and the, and the home, home of the brave. Amen. 
Amen. Uh, you'll find the prayer for the state of Israel in Hebrew in the middle of page 289, and it will be led for us today by Jeff Hirok. Avinu Shabbat Shemayim. So Israel, the Galo, Barak et Midat, Israel, the Sheets Michat, Gulatinu. Again, Alecha, the Azrat Hastecha, Ufrosh Alecha, Shukat Somecha, Ushlach Oracha, the Amitaka, the Rasheha, Sereha, the Azateha, the Daknem, the Atsa, Tova, the Planeka, Hazak et Ide, Mige, Eret, Kodjinu, Achilem, Alenu, Ushua, the Aterat, Nitzahon, the Atat Rem, the Tata Shalom, the Eretz, the Simchat Olam, the Shubeha, the Nomar, Amen. A few weeks ago, I attended an online Shiva Minion for the father of a friend. Rabbi Jill Hammer shared a teaching about the mourner's Kaddish that really touched me. She said, we recite Kaddish as a way of stitching together the worlds. We recite Kaddish as a way of stitching together the worlds as a way of bringing our loved ones to be present with us in this world, in our hearts, in our minds, as a way of keeping them close for a few moments each day, each festival, each year. Liturgically, Kaddish functions as a seam that separates and stitches together the different parts of our prayer services. It was initially recited upon leaving the house of study a bridge between study, prayer, and action, an intention for weaving Torah into life beyond the Beit Midrash. Just after Purim, we moved our congregation's activities from Spruce Street to BZBI online. As our community members have lost loved ones, parents and partners, throughout the pandemic, as we have marked yard sites, we have logged on to Zoom to pray together and to recite Kaddish. Each minion, I've been wowed by the mystery and the miracle, the surprising intimacy of coming together online. And I have ached for the physical presence of others for which there is no substitute. We gather each of us in our own homes, our own little boxes sewn together by code, strings of zeros and ones. Please unmute yourselves, we request when it comes time for Kaddish. Let us know you are here, present with those in mourning. As we answer, Amen, we do what we can to stitch together the worlds. In the book of Ecclesiastes, we read, La Col a season is set for everything, a time for every experience under heaven. A time for rending and a time for stitching. In Jewish tradition, we have a custom of kriya, of tearing a garment to mark loss as a physical expression of grief. This custom dates back to our Near Eastern ancestors. In the Tanakh, Jacob tears his garment when he fears his beloved son, Joseph, has died. David tears his cloak when he learns of the death of his beloved friend, Jonathan. Job tears his clothing when he learns that all of his beloved children are gone. In our biblical narratives, the rending of a garment in grief is seen not only as a response to the death of a close relative, but
but as a response to a variety of life-altering losses and traumas. Joshua tears his garment in response to Israel's blasphemy and betrayal. Tamar tears her cloak after surviving a sexual assault. Mordechai tears his clothing upon hearing that the Jewish people are slated for destruction. When we face an excruciating loss, the, the tear is a sign on the outside that mirrors the rupture we feel on the inside. This past summer, I had the privilege of studying about the ritual of Kriya with Rabbi Malila Helner Eshed of the Shalom Hartman Institute. She taught that tearing our garments in mourning is about the end, the final tear that separates between the living and their beloved that has just died. It is the tear between the living and the dead that cannot be mended, not in crude stitching or basting, and not in beautiful embroidery at least not in the beginning. Kriya is the time for tearing and shattering. There will yet come days for mending and healing, but now the heart is wide open and the tear is real and it creates a roaring abyss. The heart is torn open in the great mystery of life and death. These days, we are all trying so hard to hold it together, to stitch together the worlds that have been torn asunder by the pandemic. But have we adequately expressed our grief at the magnitude of loss we have sustained? Nearly one million people around the world gone. In our country, over 200,000 lives lost. Have we taken the time for tearing? La col zman. For everything, there is a time. Et li croa ve'et li tfor. A time to tear and a time to sew. The world needs face masks, we read in the headlines in March. There was a shortage of personal protective equipment for healthcare workers around the country, around the globe. It was a spring of anguish, of isolation and separation. Families of COVID patients connected with loved ones only over iPads, nurses and doctors tried to bring comfort to those who were dying alone. And this is still happening. And back in March, a call went out to all people with sewing skills to make masks for those on the front lines fighting the lethal novel coronavirus. A number of members of our BZBI community and friends in our neighborhood got to work cutting cloth, moving needles in and out, pushing pedals on sewing machines. A wartime effort to provide protection for those at risk, to maintain connection a stitching together of worlds. After Pesach, Yosef and the kids and I spent an unexpected blessing of a month in my childhood home, potting with my parents in Plainsboro, New Jersey. Rummaging in the basement, I found a stuffed pig pillow I had sewn from a pattern in life skills class in middle school. In seventh grade, Mrs. Kempler taught us how to sew how to reattach buttons that had come loose from shirts. Mrs. Kempler was from Brooklyn. She was wonderful, and I can still hear her saying the word seam ripper. I remember how she'd say, if Mrs. Kempler tells you that you have to use the seam ripper, that's a bad thing. My great-grandfather, Ephraim, escaped conscription in the Tsar's army in Poland. He became a tailor in Lansing, Michigan. My own sewing skills never progressed beyond the seventh grade. During this season leading up to Yom Kippur, for centuries, Jewish women in Eastern Europe would bring balls of cotton thread to the cemetery. And they would encircle the graves where loved ones were buried with string. They would take the thread home and turn it into wicks for candles. They would then donate these candles to the Beis Medrash, the house of study, to provide light on Yom Kippur. While laying the wicks, 
Women would recite trinas, prayers and supplications, seeking atonement. They would call on ancestors, those who had already died, the generations who came before, all the way back to the matriarchs and patriarchs, even Adam and Eve, to awaken God's mercy, to intercede on their behalf so that they would be sealed in for a year of life touching the thread to the earth, sending up prayers, transforming string to smoke. For generations, our ancestors have been stitching together the worlds. La kol zman, for everything, a time. Et li tfor ve'et li kroa, a time to sew and a time to rend. And as we stitch, have we taken the time for tearing? If we were to light a Yartzeit candle for each of the more than 204,000 individuals who have died of COVID-19 in our country, if we took five seconds to light each candle, it would take nearly 12 continuous days and nights to light all the candles. If we were to tear three inches of cloth for each life lost, that tear would stretch all the way from Philadelphia to Washington, D.C. Rabbi Elliot Kukla, a hospice chaplain with the Bay Area Jewish Healing Center, wrote last month in the foreword that there is a cavernous absence of public grieving for the momentous losses we are all facing in 2020. He argues that this is because Early on, our country adopted a convenient and false narrative that COVID kills only those who are elderly with compromised health, people on the margins. It has disproportionately affected black and brown and poor Americans, those whose lives are devalued in our society. And as such, as a nation, we have allowed ourselves to avoid properly mourning our collective loss of hundreds of thousands of people of all ages and all races and classes and abilities. A death toll comparable to the entire population of the city of Rochester, New York. Rabbi Kukla cautions us, mourning is humanizing and its absence cracks open the door to atrocities. Mourning is humanizing. Its absence cracks open the door to atrocities. To grieve a loss of a life is to assert that that life had value, that it was, that it is still holy and singular, woven in the divine image. La kol zaman. There is a time for holding everything. There is a time for tearing and a time for repairing. This has always been our work as a Jewish people, this bearing witness to the brokenness, this striving to stitch together the worlds. On Yom Kippur, we sit with the torn fabric of relationships, with the rifts in our families and communities and our spirits. And on this day, we feel the coming together of generations, past, present, and future, as we perform ancient rituals and hear echoes of our ancestors' worship crossing our lips. We reenact the awe-inspiring rituals of atonement of a world that once was, the cult of the priesthood in the holy temple of Jerusalem that has ceased to exist. We carry the grief of our ancestors who tore their clothing as they lived through the Chorban, the destruction of the temple, the end of their world as they knew it. And it is life affirming the way words are stitched together in our machsor and in the hands that carry them. We are acutely aware of the absence of our loved ones who have died on this day and we seek out and we bring close their continued presence in us. True grief is an expression of praise, of love for that which we have lost. And on this day, grief and praise are woven together. 
the author Martine Brechtel writes, grief is praise because it is the natural way love honors what it misses. Grief is praise because it is the natural way love honors what it misses. Brechtel says that we know grief and praise intimately from the very beginning. Each child is born grieving the loss of the proximity of the heartbeat of our mother. And Prechtel teaches that this loss is so massive that all of us as newborns utilize the very first inhalation of our lungs to cry out in grief. This life-giving grief wail of a newborn baby is the most profound form of praise for being alive. La col Zman, be'eit lechol chefetz tachat hashemayim. A season is set for everything, a time for every experience under heaven, and perhaps not separate times, but a time when it's all right here and spilling over in our hearts. A time of weeping and laughing, mourning and dancing, grieving and praising, all in the same breath. Eight likroa the eight lit for a time for rending and a time for mending. On Yom Kippur, we show up with our hearts torn open, seeking reunion with God, seeking reconciliation with one another. We sit at the edge of the unknown, hovering in the borderland between life and death. We draw our ancestors close. We allow ourselves to grieve the lives lost, the possibilities lost, the skins shed, the worlds that have died. The day of Yom Kippur calls us to be present in the fullness of our experience, to love what we love, to long for that which we long for, to glimpse and yearn for all that we can yet become. Through expressing our grief and our praise, we begin this work of mending our world. Today, as we recite Yisker, as we move through Musaf's avodah and martyrology services, may we give ourselves permission to feel all the things at once. May we allow the memories of our loved ones to nourish our hearts. And may our hearts stay awake and open. May we be granted the courage to mend and to rend, to tear and to repair, to stitch together the worlds. May the souls of our loved ones be bound up in our lives for all time, and may our names be fastened in the book of life. Gemar Khatima Tova. In just a few moments, we'll move into our Yisker service. As I was preparing this sermon, a song came up on the radio called, Keep Me In Your Heart For A While. And it was a version of the song by the Wailing Jennies. And I was so taken by this song, I did a little research and learned that it was written by a singer and songwriter, Warren Zevon of Blessed Memory. When Warren Zevon learned that he had incurable cancer, he picked up his guitar and he wrote this song intended to be a farewell. His instructions for stitching together the worlds. He sings, you know, I'm tied to you like a button on a blouse. Keep me in your heart for a while. So I'm going to go into the sanctuary um, where we will begin our Yisker service and Yosef and I will uh, sing this song before we enter into the prayers of Yisker. Shadows are falling and I'm running out of breath. 
Keep me in your heart for a while. If I leave you, it doesn't mean I love you any less. Keep me in your heart for a while. When you get up in the morning and you see that crazy sun, keep me in your heart for a while. There's a train leaving nightly cold when all is said and done. Keep me in your heart for a while. la 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 Keep me in your heart for a while. sha la 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 Keep me in your heart for a while. Sometimes when you're doing simple things around the house, maybe you'll think of me and smile. You know I'm tied to you like the buttons on your blouse. Keep me in your heart for a while. Hold me in your thoughts. Take me to your dreams. Touch me as I fall into you. When the winter comes, keep the fires lit. And I will be right next to you. Engine drivers heading north up to Pleasant okay. Street. I'll be back here at 1 o'clock to leave. You never be right here. Your heart for a while. These wheels keep a turning, but they're running out of steam. Keep me in your heart for a while. 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 You'll find the Yisker service beginning on page one in the Book of Remembrance and page 290 in Machzor Lev Shalem. Adonai ma'adam v'tida'ehu v'nadam v'tichashvehu Adam la hevel dama yamav ketzel hover baboke yatzit vechala leerev yimolel v'yavesh. Invite you to join me in reading responsively on the first page of the Book of Remembrance. <laughs> There is a time for everything. There is a time for all things under the sun. A time to, to be born and, and a time, time to, to die. die. A time to laugh, a time to cry. A time, a time, time to, to dance, dance and, and a time, time to mourn. A time to seek and a time to lose. A time, a time to, to forget, forget and, and a time, time to, to remember. remember. This day, in sacred convocation, we remember those who gave us life. This day, we remember those who enriched our life with love and with beauty, with kindness and compassion, with thoughtfulness and understanding. 
This day we renew the bonds that bind us to those who have gone the way of all the earth. And As we reflect, reflect upon those whose memory moves us this day, day we, we seek consolation and the strength and the insight born of faith. Tender as a parent with their children, Adonai is merciful with God's worshipers. God knows how we are fashioned. God, God remembers, remembers that, that we are dust. dust. Shuva Adonai Ad Matai Vinachei Malavadecha Shiviti Adonai Lenegdi Tamid Kimimini Baal Evot Lachain Samach Livi Viagel Kevodi Ach betzari yishkon la'avetach. We rise and continue in personal reflection with the Yisker prayers in the Book of Remembrance, pages 4 through 8, in the Machzor, page 291. Among the souls our congregation lost this year was the beloved teacher of Torah, Rabbi Ezekiel Nisim Musliach, who read from the Sefer Torah here at BZBI for 30 years, who filled this sanctuary with the sound of Torah, with the flavor of Torah, with a living embodiment of the stories of Torah. So as we call on members of our congregation to share our lost and, their lost and found reflections with us, we turn now to Heidi George with this remembrance of Rabbi Mitzliach. This year, our BZBI community suffered an irreparable loss the loss of Rabbi Ezekiel Nisim Musleach. 
Some years ago, Rabbi Stone wrote a brief essay entitled, Torah as a Spiritual Garment. In it, he writes of the rabbinic tradition of Torah Lashma, of learning Torah for its own sake. He also states that the very goal of spirituality is to refine the soul in order for this spiritual garment to affix itself to one's soul. A person whose soul is prepared to bear Torah is one who is able to emulate the midot of a spiritual master. Midot such as kindness, patience, humility, and righteousness. Rabbi Musleya was such a soul, a soul affixed to the spiritual garment of Torah. Rabbi Musleya read Torah at BZBI for 30 years. We were the beneficiaries of his love of Torah. But Rabbi Musleya did more than read and teach Torah. He brought holiness into the world. This was his timeless gift to us, holiness. We turn in our Yisker books to page nine. We recall in loving memory each and all of our BZBI congregants who passed away since last Yom Kippur. We remember Doris Berger, Edgar Goldenberg, Peter Leakum, Rabbi Ezekiel Nisim Musliach, Chedva Shakman, Henry Siegel, Ira Silberman, Richard Wallace, and Renee Zaritsky. May God remember the souls of our friends, members of this holy congregation who have gone to their eternal home. May their souls be bond, bound up in the bonds of life and may these moments of meditation strengthen the ties that link us to their memory. May they rest in peace forever in God's presence. And we say, Amen. Amen. We rise for the memorial prayer, El Malay Rachamim, at the bottom of page 10 in the Book of Remembrance, page 293 in Machzor Lev Shalem. Amen. <laughs> Kizar Haraki Amazirim Lenishmot Kol Ele Sheis Karnu Ayom Livracha Shalchu Leolamam Began Eiden Teimenu Chatram Anna Balachamim, as the rain beset her can affecha leolamim. Utsuror bitsrachaim et nishmatehem. Adonai unachalatam. Vianuku vishalom al mishkevotehem. Venomar. Amen. We look to Psalm 23, page 11 in the Book of Remembrance, page 293 in the Machsar. <laughs> He not the shayar be 
Tzaini, Amei Menuchot Yinaleini. Nafshi Yeshovev, Nafshi Yeshovev, Yan Cheni V'maglei Tzedek, Leman Shemo Kam ki eilech Begei Shemen Roshi, Kosi Revaya. Ach, Tov, Ach, Tov, Ach, Shafti Shafti Beveit Adonai Shafti Beveit Adonai Leorech You'll find Mourner's Kaddish on page 14 in the Book of Remembrance and page 294 in the Machzor. Yitkadal, Yitkadash, Shemei Rabbah, Be'alma, Divra, Chirutei, V'yamlich, Malchutei, V'chai Echol, Echon, V'chai Dechol Be'i Yisrael, V'agala, V'zman, Arik, Ru, Amen. Yeshme Feel free to be seated as we not work right this page two hundred ninety-five. Ashre Yoshe Vetecha, O Dialelu Casella, Ashream Tacahala, Ashream Shadunayan, T. 
Tila da da na i da ber pi vi vare chovas har shem gad shol leolam vaed va nach nu nevarich ya mi atavi adolam hallelujah. We turn to page two hundred ninety-eight as we conclude our Torah service. I la 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 Eilecha v'nashuvacha des yameinu kadesh yameinu kekede alalai hashiveinu Adonai eilecha uh, it is halftime here at Yom Kippur Services, and I'm very uh, grateful that Doug Barg now is going to lead us in a few minutes of uh, stretching to get the energy flowing so that we can go with strength and power into the Musaf service. We need this. Oh, okay. It really excited me with the with the potential and the significance. Um, it's very short. It says it basically, Hanishama uh, Lach Vihaguf Palach, which the Machsor translates as uh, the the soul is yours, and the body is your creation. Um, another equally va valid interpretation of that is the breath is yours and the body is your creation. And it's with that thought in mind that I'd like you to go through with me, um, if you're interested and able, a um, short series of exercises that are basically going to loosen us up and maybe reconnect us uh, with the importance of the breath and the soul. So, if you will, and for everybody here, if you want to participate, you're going to have to move into the aisles. Because you need some moves to move a little bit. And just allow, you, <laughs> allow yourself enough room to stretch your arms out. All right. So put your uh, feet about uh, shoulder width apart, hip width apart. Bend your knees slightly. Very important. You don't want to ever extend your knees all the way. Uh, feel like there's a weight hanging off your tailbone and another string extending from, your, from the top of your head up into the sky. Now straighten your spine out. Uh, let your hands drop to your sides. Relax your shoulders. Relax the, the spot between your shoulder blades. Just let all that tension go. 
We want to open ourselves up today as much as we can, and releasing tension is a big part of that. Okay, now we're just going to take our hands, palms facing up, and we're going to let them cross as we inhale. We're going to inhale from the belly. And just let the diaphragm relax to exhale. So we're going to inhale. Palms face you, then face down, and then exhale. Inhale, palms facing up. Feel your entire body expand. Feel the breath, the soul, filling all the interstices between your bones. Imagine a big glowing ball of light and energy as you inhale the expanse. Let me extend a little bit as you come up, and then drop back down. One more. Shake out, let everything relax. Now we're just going to very gently drop the chin to the chest. Keep your shoulders down, let them relax. And as you breathe in, lift your head back up, and point your chin to the sky. Back down again, exhale. Inhale, come back. Exhale. And into center. Now again, keeping your shoulders relaxed, you're going to touch your left ear to your left shoulder, turning your head sideways, keeping your chin pointed straight in. And up. And the other side. Exhale. Inhale up. Exhale down. Come back to center. Now we're going to do some neck rolls. Head forward. To the left, keep your chin pointed forward, your shoulders down. And around. To the right, forward, to the left, back, to the right, down. Let's go the other way. The right, back, left, forward. You may hear some crunching going on in your neck bones, that's fine. And back to center. Okay. Now, let's take our fingers, interconnect them, palms facing up. Again, keep the knees bent. This is really important for this one. You don't want to lock out your knees. We're going to inhale and extend our hands up over our head and watch them as we go. Lift up on your toes, but don't extend your knees. Palms facing up, fingers pointing at each other. What we're going to do is turn the hands over so we're forming a target, a triangle. And we're going to bend 
from here and at the knees, keeping the back straight like this. Inhale and then exhale. Back straight, release the hands at the bottom and then palms facing up. Breathe in, bringing the energy up with it. And down again. Next, what we're going to do, widen your stance just a little bit, we're going to turn our hips, turn our knees, our hips. And the trick to this exercise is to keep the nose and the navel in the line. Like that and see my shirt. Okay? Now we're going to do this by simultaneously opening one hip and closing the other. So the energy of the turn is happening from the hips. You're not working your spine. Okay, from the back, we open up, close here, and continue to open and close. Relax the arms at your sides. See if you can get them to be like any. Absolutely no energy. And then increase the opening and closing. And if your arms are really relaxed, they're going to swing on their own. Keep your nose and your navel lined up. Don't twist your back. You don't want to twist your knees. gather some of that energy again go back to our breathing very very simple the palms facing up at the waist we're going to breathe in turn the hands over and exhale bring them back inhale down, let your whole body to expand as you inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Relax. Okay. One last one. This is a little bit trickier. And it requires you to really, really relax and let the energy carry your arm movements. You're not going to move your arms, you're going to let them ride the inhaled energy. So basically what you want to do is put your, um, this will be your, your right hand just below the navel, left hand over it, palms facing up. This is called silk reeling. And what we're going to do is as we inhale, Hand is going to extend out, palm facing up the whole time. Out and around, inhale, 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 and then exhale. Right around and back. All right? So here we go. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now we're going to shift directions, go back the other way. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. 
Exhale. Inhale. Last one. Exhale. Switch your hand positions. Go with the other hand now. Now, just to add a little bit more to this, imagine that you have a full little cup of hot tea in your hand. You don't want to spill it. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Relax. Let's grab a big ball of energy and bring it back into us. So we're more than chronologically more than halfway through the holiday. Um, but subjectively, maybe not so much. Use these these practices during the rest of the day to give yourself energy. Martha. Thank you, Doug. We're going to turn now to the Chatzik Kaddish that precedes the personal Amidah for Musaf. You'll find the Chatzik Kaddish at the bottom of page 298 and the personal Amidah for Musaf beginning page 300. It kadah, it kadah, shemay raba, biyahalma di birachirute, biyameli chmachute.
Sound is working.
שכל המלאכים שמלא תפילות יביאו לפני חיזי חברותיך ומעבור כל הצדיקים, החסידים, התמימים והישרים ובעבור כבוד שמך הגדול והנורא כי אתה שומע תפילת עמך ישראל ורחמים ברוך אתה שומע תפילה turn to page 313 for the repetition of the Amidah. We rise as we're able and invite all of us to do what we need to take care of our, our bodies on this long day. <laughs> Eloi Avoteinu Ohe Avraham Elohe Yitzchak Ve Elohe Yaakov Elohe Sarah Elohe Rivka Elohe Rachel Ve Elohe Leah האל הגדול, הגיבור הנורא, אל עליון, כומר חסדים טובים וקונה הכל, וזוכר חסדי אבות, ומביא כהן לבני בניהם, למען שמו יהבה. ניסול חכמים ונבונים ומלמד דעת מבינים אבטחה פי בתפילה ובתחנונים לחלות ולחנן פני מלך אתה גיבור לעולם אדוני, מחיי מתים אתה רב להושיע. מחלקל חיים בחסד, מחיי מתים ברחמים רבים. סומך נוכלים ורופא חולים ומתי אסורים ומקיים אמונתו לשני עפר חבל גבורות ומידו מלאך 
Lachayot metim Baruch Ata Adonai Mechaye Amitim Amen Page 315 Vechein Lachata Legidusha the ark is open, the Unetan is open. Untane tokef kedushat hayom, ki hu norav Uvo tina se mahutecha, vi con bechesed kisecha, vete sheva la demet. Emet ki ata hudayan. Umochiach viodea vae vechote vechote vesofer umone vetis kor kol hanishkachot vetiftach et sefer. Et <laughs> Roe, roe, roe. 
כן תעביר ותספור ותמנה ותבכור לנפש כל החי ותחתוך קצבה לכל בריאה ותכתוב את גזר דינם בראש השנה ייכתבון וביום צום כיפור יחתמון בראש השנה ייכתבון וביום צום כיפור יחתמון כמה יעברו וכמה יברעון מי יחיה ומי ימות מי בקיצו ומי לא בקיצו בראש השנה ייכתבון וביום צום כיפור ייכתבון ביוש השנה ייכתבון וביום צום כיפור ייכתבון מי האש ומי המים מי בחרב ומי בחיה מי ברעב ומי בצמא מי ברעש ומי במגפה מי בחניקה ומי בזקילה בראש השנה ייכתבון וביום צום כיפור יחתמון בראש השנה ייכתבון וביום צום כיפור יחתמון מי ינוח ומי ינוע מי ישקיט ומי יטורף, מי ישלב ומי יתייסר, מי יעני ומי ישיר, מי יושבר ומי ירום. ותשובה ותפילה, ותפילה וצדקה, מעבירין את רוע הגזירה. ותשובה ותפילה, ותפילה וצדקה. מעבירים את רוע הגזרה. יאללה לילה 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 איי לאי, איי לא לא לא, איי לא לא לא, איי לא לא לא, איי לא לא לא, מעביר. איי לא 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 לא, איי לא לא לא, איי לא לא לא, איי לא, את רוע הגזירה. כי כשימך כן תהילתך, קשה לכעוס ונוח לרצוס, כי לא תחפוץ במות המת, כי אם בשובו מדרכו וחייו, ועד יום מותו תחכה לו. 
אם ישוב מיד תקבלו. אמת, אמת, כי אתה הוא יוצרם, ואתה יודע יצרם, כי הם בשר ודם, אדם יסודו מעפר וסופו לעפר, בנפשו יביא לחמו, בנפשו יביא לחמו. משהו כחרס הנשבר, כחציר יבש וכציץ נועל, כצל עובד וחנן כבה, וכרוח נושבת, וכאבק פורח, וכחלום יעוף. ואתה הוא מלך אל חי וקיים. לי 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 אין כי צבא אין כי צבא לשנותיך ואין קץ ואין קץ ליורך אורך ימיך אנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנדנ
Eloheinu, who have you, Malkeinu, Moshiainu, Lehuvehu, Yashmiainu, Yashmiainu, Berachama. We are seated. We are in the middle of page 318. <laughs> Vitsadekiha <laughs> Amusecha tu kidash adon akol masecha tu kidash adon akol masecha alai 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 Three hundred Maguda <laughs> Shimecha nora koma shebarata. 
Ten kavo da dona ilia mecha, tila leyecha veti kvale dorshecha, ufit chon per la miachalim lach, simcha leyartzecha vesaso leirecha. Simcha learzecha, v'sasa leirecha. Utsemichat kerem David avdecha, v'arichat ner leven Yishai meshichecha, b'mheira v'yameinu. Sadikim yir uvi smachu, visharim yalozu, vachasidim berina yagilu, vola tatik vaot pi avachol harisha kula ke asha andichle kitavir mem shelet zadon mi. Page 322. <laughs> Tivarichu shem kivodecha, veitnu lecha ketemelucha, viyagidu veim tikecha, veitnu lecha ketemelucha, I did it a la 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 Ve'yiftechu harim rina, ve'yitnu lecha ketem elucha, ve'yitalu im b'malchecha, ve'yitnu lecha ketem elucha, ve'yikabelu al machutcha leyem, 
Page three hundred twenty-three. Kadosh Kamur, 
ובעשור לחודש השביעי הזה מגרי קודשי ילחם. ויניתם את נפשותיכם גם מלאכת עבודה לא תעשו. וקרבתם עולה לאדוני ריח ניחוח בר בן בקר אחד איל אחד כבזים בני שנה שבעה תמימים יילחם. ומנחתם בנזקיהם כמילו דר שלושה שונאים לעיל, לפר שני שונאים לעיל, וישראל נקבס ויין כי נזכו, ושני שעירים נכפר, ושני תמידים כהלכתם. We turn now to Kara Levinson for her lost and found reflection. Last summer, before COVID-19 wreaked havoc with our lives, I had the opportunity to attend a Shabbat weekend led by Rabbi Ron Isaacs. It was up at Camp Ramah. And he talked a lot about gratitude and explained that one of the reasons many observant Jews try to say a hundred blessings a day is so they have the opportunity to reflect on all the things they're grateful for. I found that idea really intriguing. So I committed for one week to notice and thank God for a hundred things I'm grateful for each day. It's not so easy. I noticed obvious things like my family and my health and small things like getting out of bed, the shining sun, the taste of chocolate, a phone call from a friend. And at the end of the week, I was astonished at how it changed my perspective on the world and on my life. I'm a much happier person today than I was before and starting that gratitude practice was really an inflection point for me. Six months later came COVID-19. I leaned in hard to my gratitude practice, made a conscious effort each day to focus on the small things for which I'm grateful, my garden, a weekly pre-Shabbat Zoom with my friends so we can light candles together, the ability to breathe. I am grateful for the time to do things that would have been impossible in my pre-COVID-19 life like starting each day with a cup of coffee and the newspaper in my garden, the time to make challah each week and spending time with my teenage daughter every day. While COVID-19 has negatively impacted virtually every aspect of our lives, the blessing I have gained is time, time to reflect, time to be grateful and to reconnect with the things that are most important in my life and give me joy. We turn to page 325 for the Grand Alenu. We are going to rise as the ark is opened and all are invited as well to uh, bow down onto the floor um, to find a space to, to do that in your home or here in the aisles. Ale Lichnei Melech 
מלכי המלכים, הקדוש ברוך continue with the final paragraph on page 325. <laughs> We move to Seder Avodah, the Avodah service. Our observance of Yom Kippur is a reenactment of a world that once was. The cult of the priesthood in the Holy Temple in Jerusalem that has ceased to exist in that form. During Musaf, we reenact and memorialize, we grieve and we praise these sacred and awe-inspiring rituals of the high priest on the Day of Atonement. Our liturgy for Yom Kippur includes a poem following the Avodah service called Ashrei Ain. And Yosef will sing a version of this at the end of Seder Avodah. And the words are, happy was the eye that beheld all this. Alas, to merely hear of it now grieves our spirits. We memorialize our Yom Kippur rituals of our ancestors, including the emotional high of, of knowing that we had collectively achieved atonement. And as we grieve for our lost temple, we remember the magnificence of the temple that stood in the midst of our people as we lived in our homeland in intimate relationship with our God. And today, I know many of us are, are grieving not being able to be in our physical sanctuary. So we lift up our grief, we lift up our longing, we lift up our awe and praise and admiration of what once was. And we pass it from generation to generation, threading it through our liturgy and our rituals. The Avodah service begins now. Um, we're going to turn to page 332. <laughs> Vashadi Levanecha Amcha Beit Yisrael Ana Vashem Kapena Lachatayim Velavonot Dushayim Shekhatayim 
אותי, ושאביתי, ושבשעתי לפניך עמך, בית ישראל. כך כתוב בתורת משה עבדך, כי ביום הזה יכפר עליכם לתעדכם מכל חטאותיכם לפני אדוני. והכהנים והעם עומדים עזרה. כשהיו שומעים את השם הנכבד והנורא מפורש יוצא מפי חורן גדול בקדושה ותוהרה היו קוראים ומשתחווים ומודים ונבלים על פניהם ואומרים ברוך שם כבוד מלכותו לעולם ועד. We turn to the bottom of page 333 as Sabrina, Sylvia, and Oscar early lead us in responsive reading of the prayer of the high priest for the new year. And this was the prayer of the high priest as he emerged on the Day of Atonement from the Holy of Holies. May it be your will, Adonai our God and God of our ancestors, to grant us, with all your people Israel, a year of abundance, a year, a year of blessing, a year of good fortune, a year of bountiful harvest, a year of prosperity and success, a year of assembly in your holy place, a year of song, a year of fulfilling life, a year of dew and rain and sun, a year of sweet fruit at the harvest, a year of atonement and forgiveness for all our sins, a year in which our bread and water are blessed, a year of rest, a year of consolation, a year of abundant joy, a year of delight, a year in which the fruit of our womb and of our earth are blessed, a year in which our going and coming are blessed, a year in which our community achieves salvation, a year in which your mercy descends upon us. A year of peace and tranquility. A year in which we go up in, we, we go up in joy to your land. A year in which your people Israel will not require support from one another or from other people, the work of their hands being fully blessed. And to the people of Sharon, he would say, may it be your will, Adonai our God and God of our ancestors, that their homes not become their graves. We look now to the Piyut Ashrei Ayin toward the bottom of page 334. Blessed were those who saw these things. Sadly, we can only hear about them. Blessed were those who saw the temple filled with a joyous congregation. Sadly, we can only hear about it. הלא למשמעו אוזן דאבה נפשנו. אשר אין נת הכל אלה, הלא למשמעו אוזן דאבה נפשנו. אשר אין נת הארץ צבי וגוי וכהן גדול עזור לעוון אל אלכם. 
אנחנו וגלותנו עצנו. יום זכרם. אל אלוהינו לדרוש ולעבדו, שכם אחד. אשרי עין ראת הכל אלה, הלא למשמע אוזן גבה נפשנו. אשרי עין ראת הכל אלה, הלא למשמע אוזן דבה נפשנו. We rise for Slichot, page 336. <laughs> תעבור על פשע ותמחה אשר העם, כיום ויתייצב במושר העם תזין, שבתנו תגשים ממנו ממש. כיום ויקרא בשם אדוני, ויעבור אדוני על פניו ויקרא אדוני. Feel free to be seated. The next section of our Musaf service is known by its refrain, Ela Ezkara, these I recall and my soul melts with sorrow. For the bitter course of our history, tears pour from my eyes. And we will travel in this section through time from those rabbis martyred by the Romans for their insistence on remaining faithful to the Jewish tradition through Jewish history to the Shoah, to lives claimed by anti-Semitism in our own day, in our own country, to the black lives who continue to be lost in the racist terror that continues in our country, and then to the tragic deaths of so many from COVID-19, the loss of a staggering number of people, one fifth of the global losses, and so many of those lives, as Rabbi Annie said earlier, coming from the margins of society, from the people who we have already overlooked so many times. And so we remember not only history, we remember the present, and as if it were possible, we remember the future. We strive to take notice that the lives we are commemorating should no longer go forgotten, and that we should take notice of the living as well. And I want to thank in advance members of our community who will be sharing the readings, Eileen Dwell, Stephen Freed, Danny Holtz, and Brian Wasserman.
of Rabbi Hanina ben Teradion. They found Rabbi Hanina ben Teradion sitting and teaching Torah in public with a Sefer Torah in his lap. They wrapped the Sefer Torah around him, piled branches about, about, roundabout, lit them, and placed wet wool over his heart so that he would not die quickly. His disciples asked, Master, what do you see? He replied, the parchment is burning, but the letters are fl flying free. I, these I recall. <laughs> The partisan song, never say that you're going your last way, although the skies filled with lead cover blue days. Our promised hour will soon come, our marching steps ring out, we are here. From green lands of palm to lands with white snow, we come with our pain and our woes, and from where a spurt of our blood falls, we'll sprout our strength and our courage near Zain and Do. We are here. Among the many losses we take note of on this day of Yom Kippur are five souls whose lives ended because of acts of anti-Jewish violence in December 2019. Leah Mendel Friends, age 32, owned the J.C. Kosher Supermarket together with her husband, Moisha. She and her husband were pioneers of the Hasidic community in Jersey City. Community members called her sweet, gentle, and full of love for others. Employees described Leah and Moisha as being devoted to their family, faith, and business, treating all employees with the most respect. At her funeral, her husband, Moisha, said in Yiddish, sobbing and gripping the podium, you gave me everything I ever wanted, and now I have to do it all without you. Leah Mendel Ferenc is survived by her husband, Moisha, and their three children, ages 11, 7, and 4. Moshe Deutsch, age 24, was a yeshiva student from Brooklyn who mentored peers from his yeshiva, was a major organizer of a local food drive for 2,000 families every year, and a devoted volunteer to High Lifeline that provides assistance for families of children with cancer. Miguel Douglas Rodriguez, 49, was an employee at the store, an immigrant to the United States from Ecuador, where he had worked as a financial planner until his firm collapsed, at which time he emigrated to the United States and worked in a grocery store while seeking work in his field. A relative referred to him as un modelo de a seguir, a role model. Chaim Deutsch, a cousin of Moshe Deutsch of blessed memory, says Miguel saved his life by opening the back door for him as the shooting began.
but then Miguel was fatally shot. He is survived by his wife and his 11-year-old daughter. Jersey City Detective Joseph Seals, age 40, was a leading police officer in removing guns from the street, and authorities say dozens and dozens of handguns were removed from the street under his watch. A native of Bayonne who always wanted to work in law enforcement, Detective Seals is survived by his wife and five children, the youngest of whom is age two. Rabbi Joseph Newman, age 72 of Monsey, New York, was described by his family. A community described him as a fartzite ish a chasidish yid, a Hasidic Jew from a bygone era, an unending font of Hasidic stories, anecdotes, and adages. Born in Hungary in 1947, his family escaped to Austria during the 1956 Hungarian Revolution. He came to the United States as an adult. He ran a grocery store in Brooklyn, drove a milk delivery truck, and then opened a fish market. But his greatest love was the study of Torah. On the seventh night of Hanukkah, he was mortally injured in an attack on a Hanukkah celebration, sustaining multiple stab wounds, and he died in March 2020 survived by his seven children and numerous grandchildren. Yehi Zikram Baruch, may their memories be for a blessing. <speaking in Hebrew> Al Korote nu Hamaro denies all goat in Zim. This is the Unitana Toka for Black Lives by Imani Romney Rosa Chapman. Each day we hazard our black lives in the court of the white world. We know our worth, yet the white world is judged, self-appointed. We pass before you to be counted. 12.5 million bodies stolen. 1.8 million mercifully avoided your shores. Stolen shores. Stolen land. 10.7 million arrived unsafely. Times 401 years. Times infinite human indignities times three-fifths of a human being, we now number 47.8 million. In the morning, it is written, and by curfew, it is sealed. Who shall die while jogging, Ahmad Arbery? Who shall die while relaxing in the comfort of their home, Botham John, a Tatiana Jefferson? Who shall die while seeking help after a car crash, Jonathan Farrell, Renisha McBride. Who shall die while holding a cell phone? Stefan Clark. Who shall die while decorating for a party? Claude Reese. Who shall die while leaving a party? Jordan Edwards, Sean Bell. Who shall die while enduring music? Jordan Davis. Who shall die while selling music? Trying to make a way out of no way? Alton Sterling. Who shall die while sleeping? Ayanna Jones, Brianna Taylor. Who shall die while worshiping the Lord? The Charleston Nine. Who shall die for a traffic violation? Sandra Bland. Who shall die while coming from the store? Mike Brown and Trayvon Martin. Who shall die while playing cops and robbers? Tamir Rice. Who shall die while lawfully carrying a weapon? Philando Castile. Freddie Gray. Who shall die while on the shoulder of the road with car problems? Corey Jones, Terrence Critcher, who shall die in the first hours of the new year, Oscar Grant, who shall die while shopping at Walmart, John Crawford, who shall die while trying, to, while cashing a check in peace, Yvonne Smallwood, who shall die while reading a book in their own car, Keith Scott, who shall die while taking a walk with their stepfather, Clifford Glover? And who shall die while reaching for their wallet, Amadou Diallo? Who shall die while running away, Walter Scott? Who shall die while asking a cop a question, Randy Evans? Who shall die while begging for their life, their breath? 
Eric Garner, George Floyd. Who shall die by the effects of supremacy, greed, and apathy? Who shall be beast? Indeed. But repentance, prayer, and charity temper judgment severe decree. But repentance, prayer, and charity avert judgment severe decree. But turning, connection, and giving, these return us to our God. Whose repentance, whose prayer, whose charity? Temper, please, temper. Temper already, temper. For sins against God, the Day of Atonement brings forgiveness. For sins against one's fellow man, the Day of Atonement brings no forgiveness till he has become reconciled with the fellow man he's wronged. From Mishnah Yoma 8.9. The Day of Atonement brings no forgiveness till he has become reconciled with the fellow man he wronged. When will you atone? How will you atone? For you, like us, will be judged. You, like us, will return to dust. Al karote nu hamarot enai zolagot gina. These I recall, and my soul melts with sorrow for the bitter course of our history. Tears pour from our eyes. Um. I'll be reading one by one a prayer as the COVID death mounts. Um, and uh, we lost my mother to COVID in April. Um, she's been in my mind very powerfully lately. Uh, the holidays were a time that she loved, where she loved having everyone together. And um, she was such a powerful presence now. And um, I. Uh, would like to thank the uh, community here for their support and helping us navigate this uh, this terrible time. Um, and uh, like all the people who have um, who suffered persecution over the the centuries that we've you know, we we remember today, I kind of will will draw from their example and their ability to look forward to a better day. And um, you know, our our presence today is a testament to their ability to see beyond what was happening at the time and look to a better future and we'll try to do so uh, myself. God of consolation, surely you count in heaven just as we count here on earth. In shock and sorrow, the souls sent back to you one by one, the dead from the COVID pandemic, as the ones become tens, as the tens become hundreds, the hundreds become thousands, the thousands become ten thousands, and then hundred thousands. Each soul a heartbreak, each soul a life denied, God of Sorry, I'm not sure when I got muted there. Um, so I'll start at the beginning. God of consolation, surely you count in heaven, just as we count here on earth, in shock and sorrow, the souls sent back to you one by one. The death from the dead from the COVID pandemic, as the ones become tens, the tens become hundreds, the hundreds become thousands, and the thousands become ten thousands. And then hundred thousands. Each soul a heartbreak, each soul a life denied. God of wisdom, surely in the halls of divine justice, you are assembling the courts, calling witnesses to testify, to proclaim the compassion of some and the callousness of others. As we struggle to cope, the souls taken too soon, whose funerals were lonely, who didn't die, who died alone, will tell their stories when you judge our triumphs and our failures in these, are, in these hours of need. God of healing, put an end to this pandemic and all illness and disease. Bless those who stand in service of humanity. Bless those who grieve. Bless the dead, so that their souls are bond, bound up in the bond of life eternal. And grant those still afflicted with disease or trauma a complete and lasting healing, one by one, until suffering ceases and we can stop counting the dead in heaven and on earth. Allah, 
These I recall and my soul melts with sorrow for the bitter course of our history, tears pour from my eyes. We rise and turn to page 346 as the ark is opened. Shema koleinu Adonai Eloheinu Chus v'rachem aleinu Vekabel v'rachamim uvratzon Et tefilatenu Shema koleinu Adonai Eloheinu Chus v'rachem aleinu Vekabel v'rachamim uvratzon Et tefilatenu Hashivenu Adonai Elecha v'nashuva Chadei shameinu kekedem. Hashibeinu aronai lecha v'nashuva. Chadei shameinu kekedem. Al tashlicheinu milfanecha v'ruach kotshecha. Al tikaf mimenu. Tashlicheinu milfanecha v'ruach kotshecha al tikach mimenu. Al tashlicheinu li'et zikna kichlot kocheinu al ta'azveinu. Eloheinu, Elohei Avoteinu, Tzilach lanu, mechal lanu, kaper lanu. Page 347. Ki anu amecha, liyata Eloheinu, anu banecha, liyata avinu, anu avadecha. Yata Adonainu Anu Kehalecha Yata Elkeinu Anu Nachatecha Yata Goraleinu Anu Tzonecha Yata Roeinu Anu Tzarmecha Yata Neoseinu Anu Peuladecha Viyata Yoseinu Anu Rayatecha Viyata Dodeinu Anu Seguladecha Viyata Kerozeinu Anu Amecha Viyata Malkeinu Anu Mamirecha Viyata Malkeinu Okay. 
shalanu zadnu hamasnu tafalnu sheke Tadika Kabalenu Kiemeta Sita Vana Page three hundred fifty one Al He Chekatan the Paneka Bonus Raton, the Hatratan the Paneka, we moved away. We've sinned through against you through falsehood, and we've sinned against you through foolish talk. We've sinned against you through pursuing the impulse to evil. Al chayjaratan lefanecha v'yeterara v'al chayjaratan lefanecha v'yodim v'la yodim v'al kulam eloaser ichot silach lanu mechalanu kapel Al Hitchadan of Panahabaha Shubhaza, Al Hitchadan of Panaka, the Tamar Shaka. Al Hitchadan of Panaka, Vena Himamot, Al Hitchadan of Panaka, Vazut Metsa. Ve'yakulam el-o'asilipot Silach lanyu, mechal lanyu Kapel lanyu We've sinned against you by throwing off all restraint and we've sinned against you by rashly judging others and we've sinned against you by rashly judging others and I'll hate your adult for neck a bit so met yard. I'll hate your adult for neck a bit more never. We all cool on the last silly Mitzvah to say, the Mitzvah to say, Ben Chish, but who must say, and then the last of the sins known to us we have acknowledged, and those unknown to us are surely known to you. Page 354. We can be seated. Heino velo yaboteinu, mechal avodoteinu miyom ha-kipurim hazeh. Nechev ha-verb chayinu v'chadoteinu mina yedei necha kamur. Anochi anochi u'machab chayech l'mani v'chadotecha lo eskor. V'nemar, machi tira v'chadotecha v'chanan chadotecha. 
שובי אליי כי גרתיך ונאמר כי ביום הזה ירבר עליכם לטהר אתכם מכל חטאותיכם לפני אדוני תתארו אלוהינו ואלוהי אבותינו, חדשינו ובצרותיך ובדינו אלוקינו ותורותיך, צרבינו מטובך וצרבינו בשועתך ותהל ליבנו ועבדך בימיך. כי אתה זכן לישראל ומחלן לשבטי שובו ובכל דור ודור ומבלעדיך אין לנו מלך מוכר וסולח אלא אתה ברוך אתה אדוני מלך מוכר וסולח לבנותינו, לבנות עמו בית ישראל, ומעביר אשמותינו בכל שנה ושנה. מלך על כל הארץ, מקדש ישראל. מלך על כל הארץ, מקדש ישראל. מלך על כל הארץ, מקדש ישראל. ביום הכיפורים. רצה אדוני אלוהינו ממך ישראל ותפילתם, ואשיב את עבודה לפי ביתך, דעתם ועד גאה לרצון, ותרצון עמיד עבודה את ישראל עמך. וכזה נהנינו בשבילך על ציון ברחמים, ברוך אתה אדוני. המחזיר שכינתו לציון. מודים אנחנו לאן שתרצו לנו ותן לנו בטח אל מישהו. אמרו דרך ודרך 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 מעולם קיווינו לך. ויהיה על כולם יתברך בדיוק בעם שמך מלכנו תמיד לעולם ועד. אבינו מלכנו זכור לך מאחר כבוד שלך אסך וכלה דבר וחרב. ורב ושבי משחית ועוון ומשמע למגפה ובגרה וכל מאכלה. וכל דאלה וכל גטתה וכל מיני פרעניות וכל גזירה רעה וצנעת חינם מעלינו ומעל בני ביתך. וכתוב לחיים טובים, כל בני בריתך, וכל החיים ידעו חסר לה, ויעללו את שמך בימיה, ירועתנו ועזרתנו סלע ברוך. אתה אדוני, הטוב שמך ולך נא אלה הודו. אלוהינו, אלוהי אבותינו, ברכינו ברכה משולשת, ואתה רק תקדו בידי משה עבדיך, אמרה מפי הרב ובניו כהנים עם קדושך, כאמור, יברך לך אדוני וישמרך. יאר אדוני פניו אליך ויחונק. יישא אדוני פניו אליך ויעשם לך שלום. שים שלום בעולם טובה וברכה, חן וחסד רחמים עלינו ועל כל ישראל עמך, ברכנו אבינו גלנגך באור פניך, כי באור בניך נתת לנו אדוני אלוהינו תורת חיים ועבד על חסד, צדקה ברכה ורחמים וחיים בשלום. טוב עיניך לברך דמך ישרא בכל עת ובכל שעה בשלומך בספר חיים ברכה ושלום ופרנסה טובה ניזכר וניקטב לבניך אנחנו וכל עמך בית ישראל 
Mechaim tovim, mechaim tovim, ule shalom. V'nemar ki vir bu yamecha v'asi v'chalash l'chashenot ha'chaim, l'chaim tovim v'ichtevehinu Elohim chaim. Katvenu v'sever chaim, chagatu v'atem v'nukim Adonai Eloichem. Chaim Kochem Hayom. Page 358, we rise as the ark is open. Hayom, 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 Ayom, 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 Tidrishenu letovam. Ayom, 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 lichtevenu lechayim tovim. Ayom, 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 tikabel berachamim uberatzon et tevilatenu. Ayom, 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 tishma shalateinu. Ayom, 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 tidmecheinu, bimin tidkecha. Kayom hazet tevienu sasimus mechim bivinyan shalem kakatu al yad neviecha vaviotim el akotchi v'simachtim avet v'zlati olodeyem v'zivchayem l'ratzon amiz v'chi ki v'eti v'eti lai kare l'cho amim Utsdaka uvracha brachamim chayim shalom yelanu l'chol Yisrael ad ha'olam v'aruch ata Adonai ose. Shalom. Amen. I have to write in the little corner here. 359. Yeah, you have left. Right. I look so religious. Amen.
שיש למה רבה מן שמאיה וחיים וחיים עלינו, עלינו יעקו ישראל ויעקו ישראל. וימרו אמן, עושה שלום במרומיו, הוא יעשה שלום עלינו. עלינו ועל כל ישראל. ויהימרו. ויהימרו. We turn now to Nikki Morris, our congregation's president, to share this afternoon's announcements. Good afternoon, everyone. It's a pleasure and honor to welcome you all to services, the most sacred of all days in the new year. On behalf of the board of directors, clergy, officers, and staff of BZI, I wish you a new year health, peace, and contentment. And thank you for the beautiful flowers, which are sponsored by Nancy Rothbard, Ryan Boucher, Bonnie and Jay Eisner, Arlene Fickler, Janet Margulies and Art Fishman, Gary, Mary Ann, Ruby Emmett, Sandra Goldberg, Sheldon Andrea Hoffman Jelen, Judy and Tom Kleinman, Rosalie Kurtz, Father Preston, sorry, Preston and family, the Rich Epstein family, Lori Wagon, and Joseph Zerbitsky. Now this afternoon we begin at 4.45 p.m. and Naila at 6.15 p.m. And the fast ends at 7.28. I'm sure you all have that time slot memorized. Information went out by email yesterday about how you can reserve time for meals in our sukkah, which will be erected on Spruce Street. For the holiday, please check your email for details and call the temple office. I'd also like to remind you that the mausoleum bar for the holidays must be returned to the office no later than October 30th. And may we all have an easy fast and may this warm friendships and a blessing of good health. I wish you all an easy fast for the rest of the day. Um, I want to also take this opportunity to thank all of the people who made this morning's services what they were to uh, Johanna Lebo for leading the Shacharit service, to Rabbi Yosef and Rabbi Annie for leading us in Musaf, to uh, Adam Laver for reading Torah and Sandy Moses for reading Haftarah, and to uh, all of the people who participated from home, taking aliyot, uh, sharing readings and prayers. Uh, we literally could not have done it without you. Uh, and as Nikki said, we'll see everyone back at 4.45 for Mincha. Gemar Chatima Tovah.